hey everybody today i'm gonna show you guys how to replace a shingle um right here we can see uh the shingles starting to fall down um a lot of the times they put it now too high so that's why they start falling and this is a previous customer he's had this this type of damage before when the uh shingles start blowing off because they didn't do a good good job since the beginning when they built these houses these houses are probably six seven years old but uh if you don't do it right or if you get the cheaper shingle this is usually what happens so i'm gonna show you guys how to uh, take the shingle off uh this is a steep roof uh, a lot of times if you don't have any experience uh, it's better to leave it alone and just let the professionals do it but uh a lot of the times we have a we have pretty flat roofs when mostly anyone physically uh in, in a good physical condition can can walk on those roofs um and it could save you some money it could save you a couple hundred bucks i mean uh prices range from 300 to 600 dollars even more depending on the area depending on the company um and uh, it's very simple um so where i have right here is a curl bar uh c-u-r-l curl bar um this is used to go under the shingle and taking out the nails so what i'm gonna do here is um just go under the shingle and just start taking it apart and, and stick it down or whatever you want to call it so this shingle that's damaged the one that is falling um this shingle actually is actually going all the way up here so is grabbing on with this one that's the way shingles shingles stay together so what i have to do is go under this other shingles and and take out these nails as you see right here i have the curl bar i just have to go like this take them out let's take this one Here we do the same thing and you gotta excuse my movement because uh, it's a pretty steep roof and the shingles are have too much granular loss and uh, they can get really slippery okay so we got it right here we got another now but that doesn't even matter because this shingle is going straight right here all the way to right here so we're gonna check for another now on this side all right there we go so we got it we got the top shingle now we need to get this now from the damaged shingle all right we got one over here so you gotta be careful just not to lift the shingle too much the shingle don't lift it too much because they'll break if they're if they're old the shingles will break and you have to go all the way to the top and just start changing them as you break them right here got another one that's the last one Over here we don't have anything so i'm gonna show you guys how simple it is take it out excuse my movement it's the slippery forgot my sponge i should have brought a sponge so it will be stable okay so i just pull it down see how easy it was and right here guys for future reference this now is too high right here this now should have went right here right here on the at least on the tar and this is too high and the gun when they used it it had too much pressure pressure so it just blew the nose through so we get this one I'm just gonna throw it over there by the valley this shingle's kind of high too i mean high nails 
It's just not good. Not good workmanship that they did. We're gonna do the same thing. Take out the nails. Over here we got another one. Then we take out uh, slippery. Over right here we just unstick it and it comes right out. Alright, there we have it. Right here the shingles are, I mean all the roof is like that, it's uh, just uh, <laughs> yeah, just by luck because because someone that didn't know what they were doing did it or someone that didn't care what they were doing did it so i mean i'm not gonna take take those out i'm just gonna nail them as they are because i can't i had to change the whole row and uh it's just you just have to do what we can the best i okay, put it down for a nail. I'm gonna put a nail right here. I'm using a hammer because uh, I didn't want to set up the compressor and the hose just for these two shingles. It's pretty simple, it's way faster with the gun. There's another one. There's another one. There we have it guys Pretty good I mean Way better <laughs> Sometimes We have to have a We have to be careful Who we hire for a roast Because uh, there's just There's the type of people that work for money And there's the type of people that work for money But also to To uh to make our customers happy, to, to, to give a good good work, to, to to make it worth what they pay for for the roof. I mean, it's not cheap to to get a new roof. And then if they mess it up like that, that's a waste of money. They, they, that shouldn't happen to anyone. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and put the shingle on right here. You can probably see the difference in color, but I mean, it's just normal, it's wear from, from the time being on the roof. Okay, so, one now. One now right here. One now here. Another now here. And right here, since we got this gap right here, I'm gonna put it the nail right here because I don't wanna go under and put it right there because I don't wanna be breaking the shingles. When they're old, you gotta be careful when moving them around too much. And then the shingles kinda, the shingles are longer than the, than the original shingle. So I'm gonna cut it. Either that or they shrink. But it's one of the two. <laughs> I'm playing, I'm playing. All right, so this one, we'll bring it down. I mean, we'll bring it up, in and up. And there we have it. That's our repair. What do we do here? Let me see. So right here. Boom, boom, boom. And uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna lift this up, these little tabs, because I don't wanna break the shingle. I can't bend it too much because they're they're already old. We have a nail right there. Right here, I'm gonna put one. Yes, because it's in the corner of the shingle where I can lift it up a little there you go right here i'm gonna have to do the same thing 
hey guys please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel so you can see future posts if you if you're having an issue issue with something let us know and uh we can try to post a video and help out as much as we can i mean i just want i like to share what i know i know i'm not a might not be as good as some other people but we always learn every day we're learning and uh if you can save some money by doing it yourself if you can if you can uh, walk on the roof safely i don't recommend it to get on the roof if you're afraid of heights because it's pretty dangerous So there's the last nails that I'm putting on. It's uh, I lift this up right here because, like I said, I don't want I don't want to be lifting up the whole shing when break having to break it. So I'm just gonna lift the tabs, and usually they'll stick down again. So they have the tire right here. They're pretty secure. Um, any any questions, any comments, please feel free to to comment. Uh, this is this is it for today. Uh, it was it's pretty simple to do a shingle swap, uh, shingle repair. Um, what else I guess that's it for today uh, like I said don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, and uh, we'll, we'll be uploading more videos more different type of work different type of repairs alright have a great day guys